It's New Tech. Happy New Year. 2017, we made it. I was worried. I didn't know who was going to make it out of 2016, but we're all here. We made it alive. And, uh, I'm <laughs> this is going to be a good year. Don't you feel that? <laughs> no, but 2017 for uh, the DFW startup community, I feel like it's going to be big. There's going to be some really big things, and it all starts here with Dallas New Tech. We've got the best startups that come through here, so keep your eye on these companies. It's going to be important. Let me first thank our sponsors for making this night possible. We've got Roger Wilco, who handles all of our video production. We've got uh, Barista Ventures. We've got a new sponsor, Bellawood Podcast. If you haven't, uh, if you haven't, is that on our, our website now? Launch DFW? Got to check that out, definitely. Uh, Deep Rapid is another uh, new sponsor, so give them a round of applause, please. Uh, Soft Layer, and of course, our uh, very reliable Dallas Brain, City of Dallas, Dart. Did anyone besides Michael ride Dart tonight? Oh, we've got a four? Wow, that might be a record. Congratu five? Thank you, guys. Do that. It's very convenient. Uh, Silicon Valley Bank as well, so... Thank you guys for making this event possible. I want to thank uh, this venue, the Dallas Public Library. We are just about full capacity, so pretty soon we may need to upgrade to uh, another space in the Dallas Public Library, but uh, we are close. We're, we're this close. <laughs> so what is Dallas New Tech for those of you who are here for the first time? We invite the very best of the DFW startup community to come out and give us their best pitch. They've got five minutes, five minutes exactly, to give us their best elevator pitch. At the end of five minutes, Michael, what happens? <laughs> They're gone. They get, they get gonged. Would anyone like to volunteer to be the uh, gong master tonight? Anyone want to do that? You want? Come on up. <laughs> this is an honor. Hello, uh, my name is Chris Mulberry. I moved out here about a week and a half ago from Houston, Texas. Right. Yeah. So the reason why I offered for the gong is I was in percussion in high school, and I love the gong. <laughs> oh, he knows what he's doing. Good deal. <laughs> so at the end of five minutes, they get gonged. Then we get another five minutes where you will ask your very best questions Please be concise because they have only five minutes to get through that Q&A round and then they get gonged again. And that's it. Um, so we're about to get started. Before we do, though, we always open it up to the community. If you have any important announcements, if you have any events you want to share with us, come on down and let us know. Oh, really? Come on. Well, I've got one thing at least. Um, Hey everyone, happy new year. Uh, my name's, yeah, my name is Rob Andrews. I'm one of the producers of Expose UX. We are the web TV show where startups come on and receive uh, design feedback from user experience experts on how to improve their products. And we're really excited to be incorporating uh, usability testing uh, going forward into our uh, show where we also do a UX audit. So we're uh, recruiting startups. Uh, how many of you are working on a startup in here, just out of curiosity? Nice, obviously, high demographic. Um, so yeah, if you'd like, please come talk to me. Um, we're we're gonna start filming again in February on a monthly basis, and we'd love to have you on because at any stage of development, you should be doing user testing and user research, and this kind of stuff is very important. So awesome, thanks. I find it hard to believe that there's nobody else that has anything going on here. Come on up, Steve. All right, anybody else? Hang on, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do one as well. So we got now, there we go. That's, what, that's more like it. All right, so one of the other things that, that we do uh, with Launch DFW is something called the DFW Open Coffee Club Network, right? So I started one downtown. It was called Big DOCC. I started one in Frisco called Big DOCC. Now we have them all over the place. There are 10 or 11 of them. Caitlin runs one of them downtown. Hi, Caitlin. Um, 
And Daniel's a regular, and we have some other regulars in the room. Um, but the point is, there's one near you. So find that thing. It's an hour-long talk about technology. It's moderated, so it's not like a happy hour. It's, it's kind of a cool format. The other thing is, Dallas Startup Week is coming um, in April, April 3rd through the 7th this year. And uh, the deck is leading the charge on that one. So if you want to get, if you want to participate or sponsor or whatever, get in touch with them. And then the third thing is, and my final thing is, on January 24th, Winston, um, we'll be at Texas Theater hosting Ignite DFW 6, 7, something like that. Anyway, so get tickets there. IgniteDFW.org is where you get your tickets. All right? Thanks. All right. So um, I recently joined the board of an accelerator called Makerseed, and we're looking for mentors, sponsors, all of that. It's um, a hardware and Internet of Things accelerator. UTD is a, it's all happening at UTD. They're a kind of a founding member. Uh, Jeremy Vickers, who co-founded the deck, he's a founding member. And um, it's going to be an experiment, right? So the idea is that at the end of this, you know, each team shows up and they get you know, like five to $25,000, I don't remember. But at the end of this, instead of pitching the VCs, we're inviting a bunch of companies in, and you're going to pitch your products to them for sales. Yeah. You, you keep all your equity as a startup. No equity goes to the fund. So just FYI, if anybody's interested in kind of going through that with us as a mentor, so some of these teams, I think we're starting in the fall. It'd be great to have you. Well, that's good to uh, follow up uh, with Skip. So my name is John Lindsay, and one of my hats is uh, the chair of the Sensor and IoT group. And actually, uh, speaking of uh, what Skip just spoke of, uh, next Thursday we're having an event, and it's basically uh, uh, sensors uh, combined with breathalyzers. So the professor that's going to be speaking is speaking on technology that uh, analyzes the uh, micro-concentrations uh, in your breath and then determines uh, medical conditions uh, based on that. But to uh, bounce off what Spring, uh, what uh, Skip mentioned, is uh, SkinAware, which was one of the uh, UTD companies that uh, spoke, and they actually won the competition last month. They're going to be talking about their technology in advance. So anyway, go to uh, DallasSensor.com, and that's next Thursday. How y'all doing? I am Keith Reynolds from Spoke Media. Uh, we are an audio entertainment company, podcasts, audio books, that sort of thing. Um, Honestly, I'll make this real quick. We're expanding like crazy right now. I'm looking for really sharp, talented people, um, and expertise in the field is less important to me than the passion and drive and a willingness to, um, or rather, a preference to not go home at 5 o'clock. Um, so marketing, social media, graphic design uh, are all things that I'm looking to fill on a freelance basis. Uh, also looking to hire producers and editors. Uh, so Come talk to me, or if you go to spokemedia.io, uh, you can shoot me a message there. Remember, I introduced you to Mark. Hey, Mark. Go to Roger Wilson. <laughs> Thanks for coming, man. Awesome. Hey, Mark. This is your guy right here. Yeah, no sweat, no sweat. All right, man, it's all you. I like that. He he was <laughs> he was ready. To, I don't know. He was gonna like he was defensive. He was ready for you because <laughs> this guy's a heckler right here. And by the way, we do encourage that. Uh, we love it when you guys heckle because it helps uh, the startups. It helps them uh, kind of refine their their statements. So, but you got to watch out for this guy. Uh, listen, the folks that come through here, a lot of the times, they are at very early stages in their journey as a startup, and I love that they come through and, and kind of introduce themselves to the DFW startup community this way. Uh, one of the things that I want to ask you about, and you can just kind of get back with me, is I was thinking, since these folks are coming through, I hate, I hate when they come through, they give this amazing presentation, and then it's like they're gone, we never hear from them again. I was thinking about maybe having a program where just during the announcements, I'll keep track of the folks that come through, and I'll just kind of give you guys updates when they hit various benchmarks or achievements. If you think that would be cool, if you want to hear about some of the folks that you saw present here, if you want to hear as they uh, continue to grow and, and uh, reach milestones, let me know what some of those benchmarks or achievements might be, if you think that'd be cool. Okay, so let's get this started. Up, up first, 